guys, so it's Monday, 11.33am, um, I don't know why, but I got up at 7 and then I fell back asleep, which is obviously not ideal, um, so instead of going to bed late to get up early, I think I'm just going to have to go to bed at 11, not ideal, but hey -o. Um so yeah, so I've had breakfast, this is not my breakfast, uh, this is after breakfast because I need to, these are close to the expiry date, um, I just had spam. Um, I cooked it for once, but yeah, I had that for breakfast. Um, so yeah, so like I said in the previous uh, uh, this video, whatever, um, I'm not going to be taking my week break this week. It's going to be next week, even though I scheduled it for this week. Uh, I'm just still so behind and I've got an essay to do, so I thought maybe it's best to do it next week. So that's what I'm doing. Or the week after, as long as I take a week break within the next few weeks, because I'm close to like just sitting there not doing anything because I did take a proper good break after the first module. Anyway, um, I weighed myself this morning because I f completely forgot the past couple of weeks that this couple of weeks, you know, that this is supposed to do with weight loss as well. So, um, well, I slept for eight hours and five minutes. <laughs> um, so, uh, last week I weighed, I'm going to sneeze, 299. And I weighed myself this morning and I weighed 296, so that's a lot of like 2.8 I think. And um, and so in total it's 6.8 since um, 31st, well technically the 30th of January, so yeah, quite very happy with that. Um, obviously it will slow down in the future, but hopefully at least I could just get, at least I'll lose some finger per week. That's what's important. So even if it's just point one of a pound, it's something that's lost. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, so um, I'm gonna finish. I'm gonna have this. I'm um, gonna have my medicines. Um, have a shower because I'm not dressed yet. Because um, I wait for my flight to warm up in the morning. Um, um, yeah, and then uh, there's dust on my desk. Um, I'm gonna study um, as much as I can, and then. Um, yeah, that's it really. <laughs> I can't think of anything else to say. Um, yeah. I really can't think of anything else to say. So yeah, so I'm just going to study as much as I can today. Um, I'll probably stop at around five-ish. Um, and then obviously I'll get up early tomorrow and actually do a bit of study before I have to go to food bank. So yeah, and then Wednesday I'm not doing anything. Thursday, um, let me think, yeah, there's nothing on Wednesday, is there, that's 20 seconds, okay, um, yeah, so I'm not doing anything, I'm obviously going to food bank tomorrow, that's all I have to do tomorrow, and then, uh, Wednesday, that's next Wednesday, thank goodness, um, I'm doing nothing, um, I have nothing to do, um, and then Thursday I have a job centre appointment at like 20 past 10, so it's not really that um, bad. I don't know why they gave me an appointment, because that's not my work coach, so I don't know who this person is that wants to see me, so um, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure, so uh, we'll figure that out, because um, <laughs> I'm just like, who are you? You're not my work coach. My work coach said, because I can't afford to come in, that I don't have to come in until after I get paid so I can actually afford to come in because I can't come in like I physically cannot and I repeat cannot come in so I don't know what they've got in their head that I can come in so um, yeah we'll figure out that because they don't do phone appointments anymore so it's kind of annoying but I uh, yeah. <laughs> We'll figure it out. I'll be like, I'm not, I don't, I'm not talking to you. You're not my work coach, so why are you talking to me? <laughs> anyway, when I go on Thursday, I'll find out and then I'll tell you guys exactly what it was about because I'm really confused. So yeah, anywho, I'm gonna go now. Bye! Hey guys, so it is uh, late in the PM right now. Um, I'm settled down, ready for bed. Um, I found my mouse. You did, probably didn't know I was looking for it. Um, let me just plug this back in. This is my wireless. I've got two wireless cables. One for this and then one for my mouse. Um, 
this is the mouse that I got when I originally got my little like laptop thingy which for some reason is refusing to charge so I need to sort that out. Um, still going to keep it, I don't know whether I'm going to sell it or not because I, I'm not entirely sure yet, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm going to keep it for a while. Um, but yeah so, oh gosh my ears, um, so yeah so I've been kind of working hard all day, uh, my brain's fried. Um, I've been stressed about some it, but like I said, past Victoria knows well. Contact someone. Now this is not to do like it's something to do with something else, with money and bills and stuff. So I was like, I'm gonna get stressed. So I I was like, you know what? I'm gonna risk it. The lines close at eleven, so around twenty past ten, I contact. Basically, there was I was having troubles with my bills for BT, and basically. I contacted someone and they said this is what's going to happen and all you got to do is wait for this to happen then as soon as that's happened contact us and then there won't be anything issues um because basically I didn't have enough money to pay my bill um and I don't get paid now until the 25th and um, so what's going to happen because I thought I had to do it straight away um but the person on the um text chat said uh, as soon as the direct debit's cancelled contact us you'll still have your services and we'll take the payment when you get paid so um and i've noticed for this and um, for a while anyway i'm gonna keep um, as soon as the direct debit gets cancelled i'm gonna i'm not gonna put it back on only because um i've seen the way you can do it i've put some money towards it i've got like a couple like 12 20 pound like 10 to 20 pound towards it uh, well actually it's 12 pounds something uh, so I put that towards it and basically that's what you do throughout the month so you're still um, paying if that makes sense we just come out of one chunk and by doing that I could do it a different way so um, I think I'm gonna keep with it obviously gonna have to remind myself every month every week uh, but I'd only have to pay like 13 pounds something a week um, which is much better than taking 52 quid at my bank account. The only reason it's that high is because uh, I most of my stuff is online so obviously I have online classes. This computer is quite slow so I need good internet and an ethernet cable. Um, but yeah, I have multiple streaming stuff so there's like YouTube, gaming, Twitch when that happens but like online calls, Discord, there's so much stuff that's been taken on the internet I knew I need to go because um, I turned my parents one it wasn't as good as mine <laughs> uh, but yeah so yeah even my boyfriend comment commented on my um, speedy internet but yeah so I feel much relaxed now because what I was doing I couldn't concentrate my studying so I kept checking this because I was like I need to do this for this and I'm like I feel okay now now I know what I've got to, got to do um, because uh, yeah, all you gotta do as soon as something goes wrong or you feel like something's gonna go wrong, just contact them. That's what I say. So, yeah, so this is a part of adult life, especially when you're on benefits. Um, you just can't afford everything. And obviously, I put more on my gas and electric this month, so I had no money for food, and then obviously, transport costs. Um, so that's a nightmare so what I would usually use for my internet bill is now going to go towards transport costs and I'm going to get money from my internet bill I won't say via a different route but um, the money from the internet bill is coming out of something completely different so um, if that makes sense I hope it does um, it's still all the same money but it's portioned off in different areas it doesn't make sense to you, but it makes sense to me in my head. So, uh, yeah, I'm very happy about that because then I'll be able to afford transport so I can get out, go for my walks, do my steps, um, get my Fitbit. <laughs> I've been looking online, uh, they've got a uh, Fitbit of cash converters. Please don't buy this before I can. Uh, but basically, I have this Fitbit and I've noticed at the beginning it did keep me motivated, but I'm just not seeing my daily progress on here. There's like this bit, you tap it and then it does that. And it's just not motivating me enough anymore. And the straps keep breaking and I've got one spare strap now and it's just driving me bonkers. So um, cash converters, where I got this from, are selling a Fitbit Versa Lite, which is the light version of the Versa for $29.99. And hopefully by the time I get paid, I should hopefully be able to get that because you get so much more with the Versa Lite. And I, when I bought this last February, March, April time, I can't remember when I bought it. Um, 
I just I was just desperate because the one my mum gave me wasn't a real Fitbit, so and that had stats and heart rate and stuff like that, blood pressure, I don't know how I measured blood pressure but that one does, that actually, um, this is it it's second hand, obviously if I had the money I'd go, if I had the money and I had a job I'd go for an actual one, I'm just like I want anything that does a job because this is not helping, it just, it irritates my skin like, it's just, <laughs> but yeah that's what I'm going to be doing next um, from the West Midlands so hopefully it'll be okay but I don't get paid till next week, so I don't know if it's still available for next week. But in January, I went and looked in January, there was nothing. So, yeah, it was. <laughs> it took me ages to find the Fitbits because there was like nothing there. But yeah, so I'm watching some journal videos um, and I'm just relaxing. Um, I feel much better now, I could just concentrate on my essay. Um, so I know exactly what I need to do. I just feel so much better now because today was a very stressful day and I didn't enjoy it. I enjoyed my studying. Don't get me wrong. I loved my studying. But um, everything else gave me much stress. So, um, yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm going to study this card. But, yeah, I'm going to go now. Um, I'm going to relax for the rest of the day, go to bed, get up and tackle the world, I guess. Tackle the day take over the world with my brilliantness. Um, but yeah, so um, mainly my main focus for this week is to do my essay, um, or as much as I can, and then I'll do work on it, because it's not due until... Oh, wait. Oh, I thought it was due on next Thursday. It's due on Tuesday. <laughs> Oh gosh, um, okay so it's due on Tuesday, I was going to say that's why my thing says D minus 8, so that's giving me a bit of a panic, because on my app, um, go on, um, yeah, on my app says D minus 8, and focus, I was going to do actual like to my EMA, which is uh, 98 days, but I thought do each um, task. So that's the TMA03. Uh, the D minus 36 is my ICMA, but after, um, after it'll be around 62 days from there, um, it'll be my TMA04, and then 18 days from that will be my EMA. So, so close. So, yeah. But I'm gonna go now. I'm, I've, I've, I'm tired. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> See ya. Bye.